Y'all need to put yourself in a perspective like you Johnny Cash right now, the man in black. Cause the three fragrances that I'm gonna bring you today from this quirky, fun, trendy niche house, different vibes, sexy, masculine, retro. We talk about the movie Wall Street. We talk about Clint Eastwood, when men were men, six foot seven, 200 pounds, solid, chewing tobacco, you know what I'm saying? Shitting on themselves. Man shit, I took a bullet and I went home and pulled it out. Rubbed a little rubbing alcohol, you know what I'm saying? And put some witch hazel on that shit. Some Vicks Vapor Rub and we Gucci. That's what men was men. Not, you know, soft motherfuckers like we got nowadays. I got a paper cut and that shit hurt like a motherfucker right now. I thought I hit an artery. I was about to fucking die and pass out. I, got a I even got a little bit of lightheaded. My vision started blurring and shit. But fuck that, I digress. Let's roll my motherfucking music and let's get into this mask. Oh shit, I think it's. Oh, I think I got something stubbed in there. You sexy motherfucker. We're all alone. We're Bless the morning, my beautiful people. You know who it is. This is your boy. C to the U to the B to the A. Yeah. I haven't done a video on this fragrance house in a bit. I'm gonna bring you three fragrances from one niche house, which I always thought was super quirky because their marketing and the way they name their fragrances and the packages and everything about it, I think it's super fun. Even though they're one of the creators of the worst fucking fragrance in history, Secretions Magnifique. So you already know what fragrance house I'm probably talking about, and it's the house of Etat Libre d'Arange. And the three fragrances I'm gonna be talking about, Je suis un homme, translation, I am that dude. It really means I'm a man, but you know, what you thought I didn't speak French? <laughs> I do a lot of French shit. Next one, Tom of Finland. And the final one is actually from my homies because I am the dude, I am the face of this company of Sempered. Boom, I got in my little Sempered white travel joint. I like this white one, it's mad smooth and soft. Rub it against my skin. And the fragrance is, you or someone like you. Obviously, they're not full bottles, they're all samples. These two samples, Je suis un homme and Tama Finland, were given to me by a very loyal viewer, my homie Louis over at Canada. A. Hey. Isn't that what Canadians say? A, 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 A? Don't y'all finish everything with A? He sent these to me. He's always blessing me with cool fucking decants and shit that I should get my nose on. So, Louis, thank you so much. I do appreciate you. You sent me mad shit. And sometimes I don't even fucking know where I put half the shit because I'm just fucking disorganized sometimes. Just a piece of shit. That's what I am. But thank you so much for putting me onto these because these are pretty fucking interesting. And let's just go and run through these motherfuckers and show you why they're big dig locker room swinging. You know what I'm saying? When dudes look at you with that face. Not that I've ever been that guy ever, but you know, fuck it. Let's start with Je suis un homme. So I believe he sent me these from Lucky Scent. You can get the samples from them. And uh, it has this fucking drop. I hate the droppers. I hate these shits. You know I hate these things because it's always this, this, this is what I fucking hate. You gotta do all this shit to stab yourself. And it's like fucking self wound inflicting. Like, there's no per, just make a fucking sprayer. But anyway, this motherfucker is John Wayne. Leather, rustic, dirty, ball sweat leather. See, I feel like it's kind of seasonal, kind of Thanksgiving holiday, because it has clove, cinnamon, all these little spicy nuances along with the leather and booziness that give it this masculine man appeal. Like I just rolled the saddle on this horse, my asshole and balls have been sweating for this long ass ride, my butt cheeks are sore from riding this big beast. That's what she said. Nice citrus notes. It's a really well-balanced masculine fragrance. Real mature, old to do, sophisticated, well-established. I'm a man's man. I love my salt and pepper and I embrace the shit out of it. But best believe my credit score is on point and I'ma thrash this little 20 something year old and let her know what time it is without Cialis. Je suis un homme just wants to be masculine, wants to be known. Let you know I'm an 80s baby that will clear your pipes like Drano. Y'all should check this one out. If you like them old school Fougere-esque 80s flow fragrances, yo. This one is fucking solid as a rock. Next one. 
Shout out to my Semper family. I miss y'all motherfuckers. Y'all don't love me no more. I don't feel loved anymore. Although my commercials stay blasting everywhere all the time, but you know, I'm an attention whore. I need more loving. I'm just fucking with you. Semper loves me and I love them. And this, and I love this fucking white travel case. I just love, now there's a lot of companies doing the same travel sprayer, but I feel like I never really had a problem with the Semper one. It's always so fucking smooth and fluid. Not to boost them, cause I fuck with them. Cause I fuck with some companies that do have the travel sprayers, but I don't know, these are just better quality. Just saying. This one is you or someone like you. This is the masculine motherfucker that lives south of the equator. This is that Miami dude who'll be impression shorties in his drop top 458 white with maybe a racing stripe just to be loud with some chrome wheels because he took the factory joints off because he wants to be all snazzy. That's how Miami motherfuckers are. They stay stunting with shit that they possibly can't afford, but fuck it. Fake it till you make it. I do. This shit is a amazing, yeah. Amazing citrusy mint flow. This motherfucking mint is one of the best mints. To keep it 1058%, this is mint amazing. This is you're getting ready to prep a mojito and you just take natural organic mint leaves and crush that shit in your hand. That's fucking what you get. You get an amazing, amazing citrusy mint, masculine, sexy, woody, green, energetic, so seductively warm. You wanna be in the climate that will give this shit the respect that it deserves. You wanna be in those high heat sea water, that mint, that open shirt, showing all that ground beef, showing all that peak. I think your chest hair is just chilling, laying on your, your gold chain, just laying on the bed of hair. And you're wearing your, your driving loafers with some linen shorts so your balls don't sweat. Mmm. It's got a little bit of a soapiness to it, but really the citrus and mint, if you like citrusy mint fragrances, this is one of the best citrusy mint fragrances that I have ever smelled. Amazing. Nothing more, nothing less. South of the equator swag. Check out Semper, they got it there, that's where I got it. Ah, next one. Now Tom of Finland is kind of like that raunchy motherfucker who be at the strip club starting at like 1.30 to get the buffet and then have the sweaty old broads with the baggy tits that she wants to just roll up after, just sit on your lap and whirl while you're eating your shrimp cocktail. That's what I'm getting. Leather, ambery, kind of raunchy, a little like, eh, you know what I'm saying? Wifey don't know nothing, she thinks I'm at work, she thinks I'm enjoying lunch, but what I'm really doing is having this shrimp cocktail while Susie Baker sits on my lap and tells me about the four children that she hasn't seen since 1976. Very masculine, little dirty, little raunchy, leather, amber, musky, woody, enjoyable. 80s flow also. This guy's got 22 years to retire. His pension is racked up, but he's ready to spend it on these skanky strippers in Queens. If I have one complaint about Tama Finland is that the longevity and the assiage of it, when I've really tried to wear it, I'd have to, I'd had to reapply the sample a few times, which is disappointing because sometimes I want to get a little dirty and skanky. I want to have a stripper sit on top of me in the middle of lunch. Not that the wife would condone it, but it's not her money. Fuck. It's, it's her money. It definitely is her money. Skanky, woody, slutty, raunchy. Dirty, hasn't shaved in a couple of days. Maybe he forgot to take a bath, but he had to go for that three for one special for lunchtime at the strip club in Queens. It's a good fragrance. If they boosted up this, the longevity and the sillage a little bit, it'd be a little bit more interesting, but you can't hit fucking home runs all the time. And those are the three fragrances that your boy's been blessed with from the house. It's at Libra de Orange. Really, really solid fragrances. I would have to go, if, we, if we're gonna put it in first, second, third place, my first place would be the Scentbird one, you or someone like you. Second would be Je suis un homme, and the third would be Tom of Finland. All different fragrances, all different vibes, all super masculine, very, very nice, well executed. Tom of Finland just, you know, was slacking a little bit on the on the longevity and sillage, but fuck it. Definitely sample them before you try it. Etat Libre de Orange is one of those funky, quirky houses that you definitely want to sample before blind buying because sometimes they might be just too quirky for you, just like me. Sometimes I'm fucking popping, sometimes I'm just a little bit too much. Either way, you still gonna love the kid. I love y'all motherfuckers from the heart, and oh yeah, which one am I gonna spray on my balls today? It's gotta be you or someone like you. Thank God, because it's an easy spray. 
Party in the club when the beat is on all night on the beach to the breaking dawn. My nuts is in Miami. Testiculos in Miami. I see y'all motherfuckers next time. You know who it is. It's your boy. Smooches! Who's best? One of them's gonna pass the test. Who buy For the fly gun holder, money folder, motor roller, star tag, when it's time to call back. For the rough, rugged, and raw way, this nigga Jay, it's a game, but he don't play. Hey, for all the chicks that got dead in the penthouse, sweet on top of my mom's crib. It's long since you never get in. It's long since that you would think that you would. <laughs>